What's up guys, Jake here. Today we're down in Florida and we're going scuba diving for river treasure. So if you've never gone scuba diving before, it is so much fun. Searching for things on the water is my passion. I love looking for people's lost iPhones, GoPros, jewelry, cool things like that. The best part is we give everything back to the owners completely for free. So if you enjoy these type of videos, drop a thumbs up, subscribe if you guys are new. Let's get all our gear on and then head out in the water and hopefully find some amazing treasures today. So this is my buddy Paleo Chris. He just pulled up on the boat and I'm so excited to team up with him. Jake and I have teamed up here in the past. We found a lot of incredible stuff. I think it's gonna be a good day and we should find some good stuff out there pretty soon. So this is my buddy Pioneer Polly. The past few weeks we've been hanging out but he's never been to Florida. He's actually from Canada so I'm so excited to show him a good time and I know for sure we're gonna have a blast buddy. I've hung out with Jake in the past looking for crystals and other things but today it's my first day in Florida so I'm excited to see what we pull out. <laughs> All right let's get on the boat. <laughs> Let me show you real quick some of the gear that I'm using to hopefully find some amazing treasures underwater. So to start things off, I have my goggles with my camera on top, and I also have an extra camera just in case if I need that third person point of view. A super powerful dive light so I can see underwater and find things. A dive knife to keep me safe from any fishing line or other debris. I also have this rope so any goggles I find, I can string it on here and save space. A metal detector to hopefully find some awesome jewelry. And I got a handful of collection bags. So this bag right here is the biggest, and this is for trash. So I'll try to fill this up if I can. This green one right here is for anything good like phones and watches And this little black bag is for some soap for the, the goggles to keep them clear. I just found my first river treasure yeah. That is gonna top the entire day This go pet the belly There we go. There we go. Nice little water snake. Beautiful, Beautiful baby. Oh, they got the coolest face. Look at those eyes. They're so far forward <laughs> I need a bigger wetsuit <laughs> It's the stuff y'all don't normally see. <laughs> this is terrible. No, I forgot something. I forgot this. This is Pioneer Polly's first time in Florida. This is actually his first time diving after a very, very risky incident. Well, I was diving alone in a river back in Canada and I was looking for gold and uh, my regulator escaped from me. I couldn't breathe, I swallowed water and I just panicked. And the number one rule is don't dive alone and don't panic. I did both of those. I'm a bit nervous to get back in, but I'm excited I'm with a yeah. pro. I'll be right by his side making sure nothing happens and uh, we'll be good, bud. I got boo boo. Oh no. I got boo boo. I'm actually more nervous than uh, I may seem. All right, Paul, you ready? I'm ready. Right, your first breath, bud. I'm getting slightly emotional. Oh, yeah? Yeah, because it's like, I miss that freedom. I'm proud of you. We'll get there one step at a time. It feels so silly because it's small steps at a time, right? But Man, it's just, uh, when you have a traumatic experience, like... It just changes your wiring. It's it does. You know, just one step at a time, you get there. Okay. Uh, we're here. We just made it to the first spot. I'm a little nervous. There could be alligators in this water. It's Florida, so I gotta be very, very careful. But it is worth the risk because we can find some incredible stuff. Let's get out of water and check it out. What do you find? What do you find? Huh? Yeah. Nice. Well, look, it's a go. bit fork. It's too bad it wasn't a spoon, man. 
spoons are later. You always got to ruin it, man. This is my best find of the day so far. Look at that. <laughs> <laughs> That's pretty cool, right? So it looks like there is some kind of credit card right there. So hopefully we can give this back to the owner. Let's get back on the water and hopefully find some more. <laughs> excited so I just got done with my dive and I found the best find of the day this is one of my best finds of scuba diving in such a long time can't wait to show you check this out <laughs> look at this this is what I believe is an iPhone 12 Pro Max so I know this phone is expensive and not only that I'm sure there's memories on here just like photos just like on the other phone that the person would love to have back so what I'm gonna do is dry out all these phones that I found today, see if they charge up, and hopefully locate the owners and return these phones completely for free. This is my passion, like I said in the intro, I just love doing this stuff. And this person thought their phone was gone forever, just like the other one that I found today. And hopefully we can locate these people and return their phones back. I hope you guys enjoyed the video. If you guys did, please leave a thumbs up, subscribe if you guys are new, but I'll catch you guys on my next adventure. Thank you so much for watching. So I just recently opened up a storefront where you can now buy official Scuba Jake or D Almighty t-shirts, jackets, cool stuff like that. The link to it is in the description below, or if you just type in rivertreasure.com, you can find it. Make sure you check it out. I would love to see you guys in my merch. This is something I've never done before, and I'm so excited about it. 